Hey guys, Pinkberry here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to install mods in a new 1.6.2 Minecraft update. Now, a lot of people have been trying to install mods, and what they tell them on YouTube is to go into their dot .jar, copy it, and replace and add stuff into it, which will not work, and it will delete your game saves and mess up your entire game and make it crash. And when that happens, you pretty much just have to delete the whole file, go into Minecraft, and re-download it. So what now I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys how to do all this without including or deleting anything from your dot .jar. So first thing you want to do is go into your internet browser and go to the link that I have down in the description for you guys. And once you get here, go to installer, click on adfly, and wait for this right here, this page, and just wait for the ad to go away. And once you have that, you just put a skip ad and it will start downloading by itself now for the sake of time I already downloaded it so I'm not going to show you guys pretty much it downloading so once you finish downloading it you will get this right here so what you do after this is you double click it you open it and you just wait for it to open it will open in a second so once you have this it's going to say install client install server or extract now you're going to want to install client and if you get an error like I did right here you're just going to want to go into your minecraft and log in that's it so now what you want to do is click on install client and press ok and right here if you did it right it should say successfully installed client profile so press ok and then just go back into your minecraft And right here, you should have ready to play Minecraft 1.6.2 Forge. And if you don't have this, you just go into your edit profile, go down right here where it says release, and make sure you release 1.6.2 Forge right there. And then just click save profile. And just click play. So now while we wait for that to launch, for PC, it is the exact same thing when you want it, it is the exact same thing, except when you want to install mods, and I will show you how to install mods on a PC in just a second. So let's just see if this worked. Make this a bit bigger. And as you can see, it did work. Now we have a mods right here. Now as you can see, we have three mods, but there's nothing in them. So what we want to do now is install mods. So right now, just make sure this is all closed up. And I'm going to actually install one of my favorite mods, which is lots of mobs. So to do that, you got to go to your finder, open that up, click shift command G, and I will have this in the description for you guys if you do not know how to get to your Minecraft folder. And I will show you on the PC in just a second. So just click go. Go to your mods folder right here, and if you don't have this, just right click new and put a new folder and name it mods with everything lowercase. So just open that up, drag your lots of mobs folder into there, and there you go. So for PC, the exact same thing. All you have to do is just go to Click Start on the on the bottom left, type in percent app data percent, and if you get a roaming file, just double click into that, and you should see this dot Minecraft. Now click into that, and you should find a folder called Mods. Now in case you don't, it's the exact same thing. Just right click right click new folder and name it mods everything lowercase now once you get into your new mods folder and and your PC you do the same thing you just drag the file into there and that's it so now let's restart it and see if it worked just wait for that click play and just wait for it to launch alright so there we go it is launching and let's see if this worked getting a black screen because I just made this big really quickly alright so now as you can see we have five mods loaded and five mods active now if we go into our mods folder we can see that we have lots of mobs and mob DNA extractor alright so just go to single player go to any world 
and let's see if this worked. Whoa, and right off the bat, you see we have an elephant or a mammoth with two triceratops. And let's just go here, scroll down, or actually, let's just search spawn. And let's spawn a T Rex. I saw it right now. T Rex and a. I don't even know how to say that. Alright. Oh well. Okay. So let's just spawn a T Rex and see if it worked. Oh, there's your T Rex right there. And this thingy right here. Oh, and it does work. So if you guys can see, this does work. And it looks like they're fighting or something. I don't know. I don't care. Anyways, I'm pretty sure when you kill these guys, they will drop something. So let me see if I can kill one. Oh, that's not the smartest idea. Let's get a uh, let's get a diamond sword. So once we get that, let's kill it. And see if it drops anything. Die, die. All right. So it does drop stuff, and it drops dinosaur skin, raw beef dinosaur bone so let's see if we can find any eggs actually oh there's one over there now these eggs are randomly generated throughout the world and I haven't really watched one hatch yet but I'm pretty sure when it hatches it hatches into one of those dinosaurs but I'm not sure which one this is but if you guys want I will make a mod showcase for this one and future ones to come and also how to install each and every single mod that I do a showcase on so that was the mod that was how to install mods on this and this should work on PC as well so I hope you guys enjoyed this and if you guys like this please leave a like and subscribe as I will be doing more mods and I will be showing you how to install every single mod I have on this so thanks for watching guys and don't forget to subscribe